Hey, what's happening, guys? This is Tito back with another video, and today I'm gonna show you the Pixel 2's camera mode, which supports the portrait mode on any device which is running on Android 8.0 or higher. And I'm gonna do it on my Redmi Note 3. So, without further any more delay, let's make it happen. So, first of all, if you wanna try this, go to this XDA post. The link will be given in the description box below. So, do not worry. Now download this Google camera port for non-Google devices. Once you have downloaded and installed the APK file, here is how the icon looks like. Opening up the camera app, this is how the camera UI looks like. Swiping from the left will get you to the panorama mode, photosphere, portrait mode and the settings. Pretty similar to normal Google camera. Here is how the settings of this camera app looks like. Now from this gesture settings. You can click a photo with the volume buttons and double tap to zoom. Next is the front and back camera resolution. It supports full resolution of both the cameras for my device. From the advanced settings, you can turn on the dirty lens warning and manual control for HDR+. You can even turn on saving DNG format for raw photos, but it's still in beta so it might not work sometimes. And for video, it supports 4K 30fps for rear camera and 1080p for the front. On the motion mode, it clicks pictures like this. Now let me dig a little more and show you guys what's special in this camera. Now let's talk about the portrait mode. Well, it takes two pictures while shooting portrait. It does all the processing with software and it does it quite amazingly. I gotta say, I am impressed. I will be showing both the pictures as it clicks one picture, then processes the portrait mode or does the background blur and saves it separately so here are the results on the left is without portrait mode and on the right is of course with portrait mode pause it if you need it as you can see my fingers are a little blurred out here but i am more than happy with the portrait mode But don't expect it to work on the front camera though. If you hit the shutter button after selecting the front camera on portrait mode, it does nothing. So if you wanna click a portrait selfie, this is how to do it. So that wraps up this video guys, hope you have enjoyed it. If you did, please feel free to give this video a huge thumbs up and subscribe to the channel right here. I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye now.